I have some seashells with Bible verses on them. This one is Ephesians 4, 22 through 24, and it says this. Put off your old self, which belongs to your former manner of life and is corrupt through deceitful desire, and to be renewed in the spirit of your minds, and to put on the new self created after the likeness of God in true righteousness and holiness. The next one is Psalm 23. It says, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy will follow me all the days of my life, and I'll dwell in the house of the Lord forever. This is Ephesians 2, 8 through 10, and it says this, For by grace you have been saved through faith. And this is not your own doing, it's the gift of God, not a result of works so that no one may boast. For we are his workmanship created in Christ Jesus for good works, which God prepared beforehand so that we might walk in them. This is Genesis 1. It says, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. This is Mark 12, 10 through 11. And it says this. Haven't you read this passage of scripture? The stone that the builders rejected has become the cornerstone, and the Lord has done this, and it is marvelous in our eyes. Thank you, Sandy, for giving me these.